Nerd Reactor, roll out. What's up, Reactorize? John here, and Amazon has just released the uh, trailer for the second season of The Tick. And the first season, I enjoyed that a lot. It was a uh, definitely darker take, more comedic take, and just a different tone from just the different ticks that we've got like from the animated show and from the uh, first live action with Patrick Warburton and uh, with this one uh, just the uh, the universe the characters uh, I enjoyed I enjoyed them and the story uh, so yeah let's check out the trailer Prime Original Yesterday you bested your nemesis Today you wake anew ready to begin following the hero's way I think you're right Tick what? I'm in. Really? Yeah. Oh. Fantastic! That was easy. I have been itching to hone that danger reflex of yours. Think quick. What? <laughs> we'll be working on that one a lot, chum. City's been freed from the terror. New villains will plunder. New heroes will rise. Oh. I'm with Aegis. We're reopening the local Aegis branch. Next stop, testing. Stand in the yellow square. The yellow square says danger. Yes, that's the one. <laughs> Sage, the supernumerary. I wield the mystic power of the blind eye. Okay. Wide. Huh. It's staring right at me. <laughs> Everyone keeps talking about this new wave of heroes. Hey, well, Trevor! This is a little fun, right? Whew. I'll give them a wave. I'll give them a damn tsunami. Miss Lint is continuing the spree of evil. It's a Spreevil! Spreevil. Ooh. Crab man? Okay. Lobster man. Getting a mission ready. Welcome to the club. You show up for a mission. First rule of the club is shut up. He runs hot. <laughs> Hello, boys. Oh. Grateful that I met you all, and I really want to help you not go extinct. Bronx Dogs, then we should do a team up. Oh, the team ups. Who doesn't love a team up? Yeah. Wow. I need to kill. You need a hug. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> hug fight. We got more power to get Give the tick a hug. So yeah, that was the trailer for uh, The Tick Season 2, and uh, yeah, The Tick is back, Arthur is back, and then we're introduced with the new heroes, and villains, uh, a tease of the villains, uh, Ms. Lint, she's back, and she's got like a new suit. So yeah, one of the new characters is Steve Ogg, and in this show, he's going to be playing a character called Flexon, so uh, he, can, he can pretty much flex. He's like Plastic Man, he's like Mr. Fantastic. Yeah, or, or elongated man. Uh, so that should be interesting to see how much of a role he has in this one. Uh, just because he is, I believe, like like a rising a rising star character ever since Grand Theft Auto V. And uh, I, I enjoyed his character in that one as Trevor. And I also enjoyed his uh, stuff in uh, Walking Dead when the story's uh, whatever. Uh, but I did like I did like the character when he has like. Just uh, great stuff to work with. And I also enjoyed his character when he was in Westworld. And so now he's going to be in this one. So I'm definitely excited for that. Uh, for this one, looks like Dot. Uh, she is uh, going on a different path. Kind of like from the first season, she's trying to go in a path of the non-superhero stuff. And here she's like, you know what? Uh, I'm going to have to become a better fighter. And now she, she wants to fight crime. So yeah, here she has the help from Overkill. And Overkill is back. Uh, he's definitely one of my favorite characters in the first season. He just likes to kill. And the tick is not about killing. So what do you have when a hero who doesn't kill and a hero who kills clash? And it's it's comedy. It's comedy gold. Because the tick will try to prevent Overkill from killing. And this is kind of like... It's kind of like Superman and Batman uh, coming together. Except Batman and Superman, they both don't kill. So... It's, um, I'm trying to think of a character, uh, comic book characters where one hero kills. Oh, Punisher. Punisher and Daredevil. That's like a great example where Daredevil doesn't like to kill. Punisher has no problem 
with killing people. And so when they clash, uh, things will go down. And then Arthur, Arthur's back, just all gung-ho about just becoming a hero. And so I enjoy that just because with season two, now we can just get straight to the story. No more of this whole, uh, should I help or shouldn't I help? Uh, but yeah, uh, season two of The Tick. Definitely looking forward to this. And But yeah, Amazon, I'm enjoying a lot of their stuff now, uh, especially with them just renewing Jack Ryan. Definitely one of my favorite shows. And also The, um, the Boys. The Boys is coming out. That one's based on a comic. And so they're pumping out with more of these comic book live action series i'm looking forward to that just because the showrunner of supernatural is working on that it's being developed by uh, eric kripke who was the uh, creator he's a creator of uh, supernatural and you also have evan goldberg and seth rogan uh, both of those guys worked on uh, preacher so they know a thing or two about bringing a comic book into the live action uh, series uh, tv realm uh, but yeah the Tick Season 2 trailer. Let me know what your thoughts are on the trailer on the comments below. Uh, with that said, I'm John, and I'll see you guys next time.